only down one horsepower compared to the Can-Am Outlander 1000R. Polaris parallel twin-cylinder engine is smoother throughout the RPM range, without the in-your-face hit off the bottom possessed by the Can-Am's V-twin Rotax. We wanted this sportsman to have a bit more of the Can-Am's in-your-face low-end snap, with an improvement in horsepower throughout. Proven to pull harder across the RPM range in previous testing, HMF's Titan exhausts are constructed in the U.S. of corrosion-resistant stainless steel throughout for long-lasting good looks. Compared to stock, the HMF Titan QS exhaust helps keep sound output within 1 decibel at idle and 5 decibels at half throttle. A spark arrestor comes standard, available in a full system only. HMF is claiming gains of up to 2 horsepower and 2 foot-pounds of torque over stock, which should give it a horsepower edge over the Outlander. In previous testing, we thought its gains felt more substantial. HMF's Fuel Optimizer is a piggyback fuel injection controller that comes pre-programmed with a base map for HMF's exhausts. An onboard push-button interface allows for easy tuning with no computer needed. A must-have with an aftermarket exhaust, it's a welcomed add-on to lower operating temperatures and improve performance. HMF's heavy-duty front bumper adds a much higher level of style and protection to the front of the Sportsman 1850. It's far stronger and more rigid than the factory-installed brush guards that come on some higher-end Sportsman trim packages. Weighing around 24 pounds, it's constructed in the U.S. of 95,000 thick steel tubing, available in black or red. It includes a black 8-inch thick aluminum skid plate, available with or without a winch fair lead. To test our project Sportsman, we returned with cross-country racer Evan Hartzell to the cross-country race course at East Fork MX located in Nubian, Ohio, the site of our 1000cc 4x4 ATV shootout. Hitting the gas on our Sportsman, things are a bit different. HMF's increase in power seems focused on the mid-range and up. Polaris Parallel Twin simply lacks the low-end snap of a Can-Am V-Twin, offering very manageable low-end power for a 1000. The combination of the HMF Titan QS exhaust, fuel optimizer, and Dalton adjustable clutch kit resulted in a Sportsman 1000 that gets off the line quicker, pulls harder in the mid-range and up, and feels a little snappier throughout the RPM range both in throttle response and in clutching. It's still the same smooth parallel twin with excessive power, but now with a racier feel.